making their way in. Did I say your name right? Did I get that right? Yes. Good. Did. Okay. <clears throat> Yes. Making their way in studio here. You're right next to the Hillary Nutcracker. Hold that up. Look at that beautiful uh, item right there. That has uh, stainless steel <laughs> thighs. It is an actual Hillary Nutcracker. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And it works. The classic. Twenty nine ninety nine on eBay. It's the most frightening thing I've seen all week. I'm definitely <laughs> taking a picture of this before I leave. Yeah, you yeah. Didn't, uh, we, don't you wish you would have had that for the movie? That would have been the, sc uh, would've would've the scariest part. Yeah. If we would have known that she was off the president. <laughs> it could have been the murder weapon, to be honest. Um, okay, so I want to play a little clip we can play here. But tell us about the movie. Which was done almost entirely or entirely here in the uh, in the in the Mohawk Valley in Utica. Almost entirely. I okay. think the only part that was not was at a uh, house at Sylvan Beach. Got it. Okay. It's still in the area. So it's still close. Yeah. So yeah, still yeah area. that's still us. And uh, all right, tell me about the movie. What's the storyline here? Uh, the storyline is a uh, girl has a premonition um, in the beginning, and um, she f comes to realize that it's slowly starting to become true, and. It's an unstoppable force that is basically coming after her friends, and she has to figure out how to stop it, uh, and nobody believes her. Uh, so she has to figure it out on her own. Got it. And what are some of the places uh, that you guys used as uh, backdrops here? Where did, you, where did you film? Well, we went to uh, City Hall here in Utica, the library, um, the high school that I went to in Holland Patton, and a, a few different houses here and there, one in Whitesboro, one in Yorkville. House in uh, Southern Beach, um, also like a warehouse that was in Clark Mills. Got it. For the for the opening nightmare scene, that was great. Nice. And, and and Ryan, you're not from here, are you, Ryan? Or which one is which? Oh, no, I'm from here. Yeah. You are. <laughs> are you Ryan? You're Ryan. No, I'm Antoine. <laughs> you're Antoine. Got it. I had it completely mixed up. So, Antoine, you're not from here, or you are from here? Um, I'm not originally from here. Okay, so uh, Ryan, you brought them. Uh, you you brought him here. You you're the because of your local, the fact that you're local, the, you did the movie here. It, yeah. And, and, and my question for Antoine is, was this a good spot? Is this a good place to, to, oh, film yeah. a, to, uh, to make a film? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Um, like, I went up to MVCC here in 2003, so I always Okay, the so area. you have a little feel. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got it. So you're familiar with the food, too, in, uh, in addition to all the good shooting locations. That's yeah. <laughs> right. Uh, let's uh, play a little clip. I, uh, I think we're language uh, okay here. Play a little clip. This, um, this segment here where they're going inside to where? Where are we going into here? Well, that's uh, in the house of the first murder, actually. Okay. And these are detectives that are coming to check it out. They're going to go this check out the scene, yeah, so yeah. let's uh, listen to Looks like we got some footprints. Probably just the girl she tried to get away. Nope. Two sets. One with shoes, one without. And we got some fingerprints, too. Oh. So we got the killer's prints. That way, Wonder Boy. <laughs> All right, so tell me, uh, who are the who are the actors, and uh, who'd you get involved in this film? Well, um, the uh, older uh, detective, uh, he's going to kill me for saying that, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he knows the truth. <laughs> the guy who played the older detective. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of makeup there. Yeah. <laughs> his, uh, his name is Thomas Wiemat. Okay. Um, at the time, uh, he was a uh, first-time actor in this, and uh, the his partner is uh, um, played by Adam Yoder. Got it. Uh, out of town, guys? Um, they're, they're local. Yeah. Local. Uh, they're yeah, local. We, we did our casting. We uh, posted an ad on Craigslist and held it at the uh, New Hartford Hampton and in Suites. Got it. it. Worked out really well. Got just about everyone we needed at that audition. Okay. <laughs> now, where can when do people get a chance to see the uh, see the movie? Well, you can see it right now. Actually, there's a few different venues uh, selling okay. it. You can see it digitally through Amazon. It's available to rent or buy, and you can also get the DVD through Walmart.com or Best Buy.com. Cool. So, is this your? Uh, tell me your background on uh, on filmmaking. Is this your first? By the way, is this your first full length? It's motion it's picture? his. It's my first feature, debut. Yeah, yeah. Got it. <laughs> very first uh, feature length film. Yeah. And, and background. Give us your background. Um, well, I'm a, as I said, I set up. Um, I went to MV and I started up the film club there, um, where I told, uh, taught a bunch of students how to make films. And then uh, later on, I uh, did a bunch of little short films up here. And then I went back to the city to Brooklyn, and then um, went to school there, finished up, got my degree, and came back. And um, the rest was history. I just started making um, more short films until I met up with Ryan Perez. Yeah. And, um, I had a script with my with my girlfriend, and uh, we, you know he read it, and uh, he wanted to shoot it. 
He read it in like two days, I think. Was it, was it like two days or something like that? It might have been a single day. <laughs> <laughs> you were uh, binge reading. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, good. Good. Uh, so, and how were you? I know Paul Buckley is the uh, is the film czar in uh, yeah. in Utica, and one of the things they've been really trying to do is say we have a lot of great buildings, great places to shoot. Uh, you can go from a, a city scene to a rural scene in just minutes. And uh, how were you treated? How did Buckley handle things? And did he uh, did he treat you well? <laughs> oh yeah, he he made it extremely easy to shoot in the city, uh, especially places like City Hall and the library. Really, just needed insurance and his trust, and we were in. <laughs> I which, love that guy. Wh- which one of you was sweetheart? Because he calls everybody sweetheart. <laughs> um, well, well, I, I know he I know he likes Antoine's voice over mine. Okay. Now, so. <laughs> All right. Okay. He's All right. He <laughs> told me to use that voice that you got for the TV spot, and he just he texted me right before he got on the show. <laughs> yeah. So I guess yeah, I that is sweetheart. you do have a great tag. You could do the this is CNN type. This is <laughs> CNN. I like Hello, it. Hello, this is CNN. Thanks. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> it's a different approach. I like it a lot. So, uh, all right, gentlemen. So again, to uh, to to see the film, uh, the two spots at least right now they can go to see it. Have you thought about a premiere? Doing some sort of a well, we did here? premiere you did, last did year. It. We were actually here. Oh, a year I remember that. <laughs> to promote that. Yeah, I remember that. You know, it's been 365 days at least. <laughs> That's a long time. Yeah, yeah. a week is tough. A lot for happens me. here. I'm sure. Yeah. All right. So that premiere is done. It's now a, you're now able to go out and uh, and actually purchase it. Again, two locations: Walmart.com. And then the other is? Well, BestBuy.com and Walmart.com if you want the DVD. If Got you just it. want to watch it at home without having to wait for it to be shipped to you, you can go stream to Amazon, it. stream it, yep, directly. Cool. All right. Well, I've I've got I watched part. I got to watch the whole thing tonight. And I, I'm, <laughs> great. I'm excited about it. So uh, great job. And to see the the uh, the the local places and all that, uh, you can kind of pick them out in there. It's, it's yeah, really cool. So all right, great job, man. Thank, Thank you. you, gentlemen. Uh, Antoine McKnight, Ryan Perez, and the film is entitled Everto.